Welcome to a video from thedigitallifestyle.com. I'm out on the road today, but I thought I'd do a quick update on the Surface Duo, which has just received its uh, May 21 update. So I just thought I'd let you know some of the things in it and how I've been uh, finding it. So the first thing that Microsoft, I've got the release notes here, Microsoft say improves device stability and UI stability, which is the usual thing. Um, improves the scenario one screen would turn black while using the Surface Duo in book mode and also the double tap issue in book mode. So what they mean by that is this is in book mode now and occasionally this, the double tap screen, which is that one that comes on when you close it so that you can switch between screens would come on when you're in book mode and a lot of people have been having this issue and it's you know, again very frustrating for some people because you know you're in book mode and it's only showing a single screen and you can double tap so they say they've uh, they've fixed that and they've also fixed a scenario uh, where the three uh, button navigation where the list of recent apps on the left screen invoked on the right screen so when you were getting up to the recent apps um, So when you were getting through the recent app screen, it would appear on the wrong the wrong screen. I, I haven't had that issue. I have had the book issue where um, it would come up single tap, you know, double tap to, to switch screens over backwards and forwards. Um, I've also found since I put this on that the camera seems a little bit quicker as well, especially for switching from screen to screen. So I don't know, this is the usual thing where when you put it in when you do these videos and test it it feels responsive because you've just had the update but yeah i am finding that responsiveness is better although my tip for getting the camera is the only time i find any issues with the camera is when i want to take a normal shot and you put it in book mode and it kind of defaults to the front cam you know front facing cameras if you're doing like a teams or a skype call or something like that um i always if I want to take a picture, just like a normal picture, I always put the, the phone in the single screen mode like that and then launch the camera and then it works every time within the right screen. But like I said, you can do the old double tap to switch around, but that's that's my tip on the camera. So those are the changes with this update. Uh, I still love the Surface Duo, it's a brilliant phone. Um, I, I use it all the time. Um, yeah, I really do like it. Uh, especially for doing Teams calls and stuff. And now, of course, if you've got the Xbox Cloud Streaming uh, service, you can, some of the games have got the controllers in sort of the controls on one screen and the um, and the game on the other screen. So you can use it as a little mini handheld. So that's pretty cool. I haven't got that set up yet, but I, I love using my Surface Duo. So that's it for this month's updates. Uh, I don't know news on when Android 11 or anything like that will be coming, but uh, we'll find out soon when Microsoft lets know. So stay tuned for more updates. Stay tuned on the digitallifestyle.com. I'm at iStixit on Twitter.